Hey guys, it's Ricardo. Welcome to another blog tech tips. And of course, today, guys, I'm going to show you to fix issues with connected to the internet on the Nintendo 3DS. And this is for those who are having uh, trouble. And I first encountered issues when I tried to connect my Nintendo 3DS. This one is updated to the internet. Now, one of the things I realized, guys, early on is that as soon as I go over here, and you know, should know the process already, you tap on the um, icon, and of course, you should see the updated screen as seen here. Tap again. And of course, close the software. Okay, I have something open. Let's go ahead and close that. And of course, once I go into the settings, you want to go to um, internet settings, connection settings. Once you're in here, of course, you can select one of these slots. You can say um, new connection. And of course, you would scan by doing manual setup. You can search for access point. And of course, once you see the access point, let's tap. And of course, enter your password. And sometimes it will fail. I'll show something on screen. She'll show you the process will actually fail in the testing phase, especially if you have other devices that have connected to the same network and they're not working. It can be very annoying once you're trying to connect and the Nintendo 3DS is not connected. And to prove that I have connected mine from earlier when I was having issues is you can see right here. I'm just going to close out, guys. So forgive me here. Just a little time. The system does take a little while to switch between applications. All right. So as you can see here, guys, um, on the main screen, you can see that it just does say up here, um, internet, and the internet does work fine. Now, the first thing I want to do if you're having trouble with your internet is, one, if you're having trouble with the internet, try to use another um, internet connection or another router. So let's say you're in the house and you have multiple routers. Go to the main router and connect to that router. Or you can go to a friend's house and connect to theirs. Preferably use a router that you got from your ISP. If you're using a secondary router such as a, one that you bought off Amazon or so on, especially one that you're using to share the internet or to convert the internet, convert your wired connection to a wireless connection, those may give issues. I found out that the Nintendo 3DS only works okay on some. All right, so if you have tried that, you can actually find out that you should connect without issues now other things you can try if that's not an option you can actually try to use um, your phones um, like this device you can actually go on the um, internet if you have um, mobile data just use the built-in tethering and actually broadcast the internet from your phone and try to connect to that if that fails you can try uh, various phones it will work with some it might not work with others so that's an option um, third if you find that nothing else works, guys, you can actually um, use a software on your um, laptop or on your desktop, but you'll need a wireless dongle and basically um, create a hotspot. You can find s several hotspot software. You can actually just search um, free hotspot software, download one of the top ones that come up and actually use and launch. And what's going to happen is that you're going to plug in a wired connection to the laptop or the desktop. And then you're going to broadcast a wireless signal. And of course, you're then going to try to connect to that, um, I would call it a makeshift wireless connection. And of course, the Nintendo might connect to that. Fourth, if that fails, what you'll have to do in your router is go in, log in. And in the settings, you'll have to change the frequency. Sometimes the um, Nintendo 3DS... Um, sometimes Sometimes the Nintendo 3DS doesn't play well with certain frequencies, so you'll have to change the bandwidth on which it's broadcasting a wireless signal, and of course, try connecting again. And of course, if all else fails, you might have an issue, especially if you have dropped your device several times, where the internet, um, the wireless radio inside of the Nintendo 3DS is actually damaged. Um, if it's a new brand device, I highly doubt that it's damaged, so you want to try and exhaust those other three to four options that I gave before. And of course, one of those should work. What actually worked for me was that I was at the office and I was trying to connect to their network, which was a secondary router that was basically a makeshift setup. And of course, it was not connecting. I tried the phone that did not work. And of course, finally, I came home to my reliable um, connection that's directly from my ISP, which was the router. And of course, it connected right away. So straight away, I realized it doesn't play well with some um, of those if you want other troubleshooting tips you can ask them below in the comments subscribe from black tech tips and i'll gladly answer them for you guys so this is regard saying bye until next time bye